Dave Bautista, by the shape of that head. <laughs> Welcome. State your credentials for succeeding Senor Scarra. Ah. <laughs> oh, no, 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 Hi guys, and welcome back to Criminal Content. My name is Kobe, don't forget to like and subscribe. Today I am going to continue with my James Bond adventure uh, and watch Spectre. So I've watched three now, my first three Bond films ever, uh, Casino Royale, Quantum of Solace, um, Skyfall, and now, um, what did I just say? Spectre. So I'm enjoying it. I, I really liked the last one, which was Skyfall, so I'm excited to get into this. And we left with M dying though, which was upsetting, but we met Money Penny, so a lot of things are changing. And let's jump back in. So for the full watch along, head over to our Patreon. And with that, Spectre, let's do it. Going into this one the most excited, I think, because I really enjoyed Skyfall. Oh, straight into the music. And I like that they're all continuing straight on, so it does feel like um, one story. This is what I think I remember the old TV show used to look like. There was a TV show, right? Or am I thinking of Get Smart? <laughs> Day of the Dead Festival, Dia de los Muertos. This is cool. Is that Bond with the skeleton suit? More villains. But what better event to be like kind of have to be incognito in? Everyone's wearing face paint and a mask. Trying to spot those baby blue eyes. Yeah. <laughs> Where are you going? I won't be long. That was fast. Oh, I love a rooftop chase. really the best shoes for the amount of like action and activity he does. That was unexpected. This badly from one explosion. <laughs> Get up. What? He'd be the only one that made it out of there. That whole place blew. <laughs> He's right there. Why can't you just run through this part? Oh, 
Seeing that helicopter like just roll and flip and pull up the collective. Let's go. <laughs> and now the helicopter's fine. Wasn't it like bleeding smoke before it had actual engine issues? But not now. <laughs> Opening credits. Great openings. I'm, well, I don't, I don't want to commit too much to be like, I'm in, I'm a Bond person. But the last one was good, and this one, I got a good feeling. Oh, and Dave Bautista. Oh, and so this is not um, a new movie. He has been around for a minute. I was like, I hadn't seen him before. And Monica Bellucci! I hadn't seen Dave Bautista before uh, Glass Onion, I didn't think. Is it the octopus? There's one called Octopussy. Or something, right? In the last one, in Skyfall, a lot of the things in the, uh, in the opening credits, you know, then became a part of the film, whether it was like the underwater stuff, um, the firing papers, like the... So now I feel like we're gonna get an octopus at some point. Um, oh, that was the octopus. Oh, I didn't realize when... Uh... Mexico City, what were you doing there? It's just a coincidence. <laughs> I was taking some overdue holidays. Not sure. 007, I'd like you to meet Max Denby, head of the Joint Security Service. Well, it's a pleasure to finally meet you, 007. I've heard a lot about you. Most of it good. <laughs> this is gonna be a whole new chapter for us. We're gonna bring British intelligence out of the dark ages into the light. That all sounds lovely. Is Q gonna be the same? That same young guy? James? Money Penny. Money Penny! Sir, how was the meeting? Now she's here to stay. Forensics finally released this. It's personal effects they recovered from Skyfall. Perfect, you can bring it to me later. What do you mean? My place, nine o'clock. That's it? From his childhood family home? That's all that they recovered? I mean, it did explode and burn to the ground, but... I think you've got a secret. It's something you won't tell anyone because you don't trust anyone. What is it? If anything happens to me, 007, I need you to do something. Find a man called Marco Schiara. Kill him. And don't miss the funeral. I wasn't going to let death get in the way of her job. I've been tracking Skiara ever since. Mm. When's the funeral? Three days. I heard a name in Mexico, the Pale King. You want me to be your mole? Yes. And what makes you think you can trust me? <laughs> Are they still sleeping together? Oh, this is the stuff from the house. Hmm? From... Uh... Order of guardianship from his parents to that caretaker man because they died or somebody else? Well, let's say he's feeling the pressure. Yeah, I've noticed. Now, this way, 007. Be careful, it's a trifle slippery. <laughs> he wasn't exactly feeling at home, so he set up shop here, away from prying eyes, as it were. I hear he's got something rather special planned for you. Gadgets? Toys? Ah, oh, 007. Q. Please excuse the mess. Everything's a little bit up in the air, but with the changes and all. Yeah. Microchips in your bloodstream allows us to track your movements in the field. You see those readouts? We can monitor your vital signs from anywhere on the planet. Ah. Call it a post-Mexico insurance policy <laughs> by direct order of M. I completely understand. I forget when they say M, they mean fines. Magnificent, isn't she? Zero to 60 in 3.2 seconds. Fully bulletproof, a few little tricks up her sleeve. Hee <laughs> hee! You've been reassigned to 009. But you can have this. He's joking. Does it do anything? It tells the time. He's messing with them. Seems I do. Precisely. The alarm is rather loud, if you know what I mean. I think I do. He's gonna end up in that car. Make me disappear. Um, may I remind you that I answer directly to M. I also have a mortgage and two cats to feed. <laughs> Trust me. 
the sake of the cat. You'd want to trust Fawn, though. He's so good. The smart blood program is obviously still in its developmental phase, so we may experience the odd drop in coverage during the first 24 hours, 48 hours after administration, but after that it should work perfectly. I'll send you a postcard. Ha <laughs> ha! Thank you. J for James. Double O nine has arrived to pick up the DB ten, sir. He's waiting upstairs. Oh, good. There's no way that Double O nine is taking that. Aston James is taking it, or it's gone already. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> what that car do though? del tuo giudizio possa risorgere con i beati per Cristo nostro Signore. <gasps> Christoph Waltz. And is that going to be Monica Bellucci? My eyesight's not good enough. She's too small. I'm sorry for your loss. Yeah. Life insurance. I hear the life expectancy of some widows can be very short. Can't you see him grieving? No. Uh-uh. Are they with her? They're all there to kill her and Bond is gonna save her. She's so beautiful. Yeah! You're wasting your time. There are a hundred more that will come after me. All you buy me is five minutes. Thanks, Lord. That's all I need, huh? <laughs> if you don't leave now, we'll die together. You're obviously crazy, Miss Sarah. Bond. James. James. Bond. When did the vibe change to kissing her? Like, it doesn't even... <laughs> Literally nothing happens to make this the logical if next just step. Knew what I could do. Did your husband ever mention the Pale King? No. The organization. <laughs> they hardly ever. But she's into it, so how about it? Tonight. Why? To choose a replacement. Where? Leaving your number? I've called an American friend of mine, Felix. We'll contact his embassy, get you out of here. You're crossing over to a place where there is no mercy. I have to go. Buona fortuna, Donna Lucia. Ferma lì. A ti riconoscere, Strong. Chi sei? Sono Topolino. E tu chi saresti? Io scusa. I mean, is that the code to let him go? But then they're still calling. It was just, they're like, go ahead. Don't let me interrupt you. The death of our valued colleague, Marco Scara, leaves one of his duties outstanding. Senor Guerra, the Pale King must be terminated. Will you make the journey to Alto C? Christoph Waltz is just in pitch darkness. Does anyone challenge Signor Guerra for this position? Dave Batista by the shape of the head. <laughs> Welcome. State your credentials for succeeding Signor Guerra. Ah. <laughs> oh, no, 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 Welcome, James. It's been a long time, but finally here we are. Oh, that's good. Cuckoo. Ciao, Mickey Mouse. Crystal 
Bob Waltz has got a great face, though. He's like creepy and interesting and funny, and it's just, it's all going on. Oh, you're gonna kill me. It wasn't finished, it wasn't ready. He took it before. Uh... <laughs> Can he get some ammunition for it? Or is it gonna be special kind that Q needed to give him? No. Whoop, I'm gonna hit the Fiat 500. Amber, Tunisia, Mexico City, they're all linked. It's one organization coordinating multiple attacks. I ran that check. Oh, uh, my boss had his credit card stolen. It's nothing. Why don't you go back to sleep? Don't be long. Oh, she has? Just a friend. At this time of night? <laughs> it's called Life, James. You should try it sometime. Oh, maybe it's something casual. I was like, I didn't think she had like a serious relationship. Looks like you've had dealings with him before. Quantum. Of course. Mr. White? Mr. White. That's him. Last unconfirmed sight. Pale. White. Hold that thought. <sighs> Wait, so they didn't... They didn't kill him, did they? Must not have. I'm trying to think back. The last time we saw him. Check his file before and after his death. After his death? What are you talking about? Please, just do it. all the way to the top. You just have to walk like this. I mean, is it always an Aston Martin and historically always been? I mean, that must, these, this whole franchise and all these films over history must do, um, must do wonders for Aston Martin as a, as a manufacturer for their sales. <laughs> Why wouldn't you want to be Bond? They could just use snippets of these films for their commercials. Aston Martin, DB10. Okay, Q, give me something. Okay. A little fire. We'll take it. Here goes nothing. the end of the car? That's how short we had it for? Look good though, look like he drowned in it. Good evening. <laughs> Everything's just so smooth. That's Waltz on the right. Time for the security services of the world to unite. Alone, we are weak. Together, there's a picture of it at that point. Maybe on security camera, but that's, it wouldn't bob up to float to that. I have him, sir. He appears to be in Chelsea. <laughs> and I get it back, understood? I completely understand, sir. He covered for him, risking his job. Austria, that's the thing about your, I mean, you can get in a, a car in Europe, everything's so small and close and drive around and see country after country after country. I'm from Australia where you cannot drive to any other country, <laughs> ever. <laughs> Who is this? Oh! Do me a favor, make it quick. Upstairs, Mr. White. Last month, I found thallium in my cell phone. It's done its job. I have a few weeks. Here we are, Mr. Bond. Two dead men enjoying the evening. He's dying anyway. You're protecting someone. Your son, your daughter. Who is it? You won't find her. She's clever. I can protect her if you tell me where he is. <laughs> I can keep her alive. I mean, probably, but... 
You save her. She can lead you to America. She knows America. Try the Hoffler Clinic. He's gonna shoot You're himself. You're a kite dancing in a hurricane, Mr. Bond. He's gonna shoot himself. Go on. <laughs> It's own like, you know, kind of come full circle because this guy, Mr. White, is who uh, at the end of Casino Royale we saw. Like that's how that ended. That image of him with his foot on him, Bond on Mr. White, saying Bond, James Bond, for the first time. Come on, Em, you can't really tell me that one man in the field can compete with all of this, running around out there with his license to kill. It's Bond! Have you ever had to kill a man, Max? Have you? No. Watch MI6 agents. Watch everyone. You watch everyone. Sometimes you just see it coming. Batista. This is very like third act of inception feels. <laughs> My name is uh, Dr. Madeline Swan. Job today is to analyze your needs, both psychological and physical. Mm, sounds pretty straightforward. As a child, would you say you were close to your parents? My parents died when I was young. Really? How old? They're old enough to remember. How? It was a climbing accident. So who brought you up? Someone else. Humor me. Was it a climbing accident? Forgive me, but anyone might think you're hiding from something. You're paying a lot of money to be here, Mr. Bond. Mm -hmm. He's looking for you. Small world, eh? Where is he? Your father's dead. Two days ago, I came to tell you that your life is in danger and I need your help. Why? I made a deal with him to protect you. Your lie. Mm -mm. I'm American. This interview is over. Dr. Swan. You have 10 minutes to leave the building, then I'm calling security. <laughs> Can I get you something, sir? Vodka martini, shaken, not stirred. Hey! Sorry, we don't serve alcohol. is that Franz Oberhauser is dead, dead and buried. And unless you come back with me right now, my career and money pennies will go the same way. Do you understand? All hell is breaking loose out there and here you- I saw him. Yeah, you thought dead. you saw him? No! He died in an avalanche with his father 20 years yes. ago. Yes. Find out where you came from this. Octopussy? Maybe we're not getting any actual, literal, Hate you right now. Octopus. Thank you, cute. <laughs> Octopi. <laughs> they found her so fast, or they followed Bond, but like, e <laughs> they must have followed Bond. Because <laughs> she's in the middle of nowhere, and they hadn't found her yet. Nice work. They must want her alive if they were just gonna drug her and they haven't shot her, so. At least that means time. Where did he find a plane in like two seconds? <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Oof. He goes back up. He was just at the bottom. I thought maybe just sneak out, jump out, and leave them in it. But they're going back up. Oof. Yes, 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 yes. So that was right then before it closed? Because it's not like these things, the cable cars don't make different stops. I mean, it's so heroic and romantic, even though it's not meant to be romantic. It's just very impressive. He's just falling and sliding. He's not steering. He's got no wheels. I have got 
time for this. You need to tell me everything you know about Lamerican. And why should I trust you? Because right now, Dr. Swan. I'm all you have. Bautista. He looks like he would be a hard man to go. Oberhauser is still alive. The ring proves it. And it seems they were all part of one organization. Mm. Le Chief, Quantum, Schiara, your friend, Mr. Silver. And do you know who links them all? Him. Exactly. And the little young picture, because they thought he was dead back then. You know then. what it's called? No. Spectre. Its name is Spectre. How does she know that? Because my father was part of it. And I think that you ought to see this. Looking at pictures from South Africa right now. I was going to guess Octopussy. <laughs> Go back to London. Em's going to need your help. And keep tracking me. I will. And Bond, you have to find L'American. It's not a person. It's a place. You know she's on board. Tangier. Travel show. <laughs> He gonna hook up with Mr. White's daughter? Because we haven't had any. Oh, we had Monica Bellucci. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Which was hysterical. This is where they spent their wedding night. They came back every year. Then they brought me with them, too. He kept coming back, even after the divorce. Well, then I'm sorry. What for? Bringing you here. And trashing the place. What is it? Your inheritance. <laughs> and now I'm going to bed. <laughs> Seeking solace for my dead daddy. Maybe not now, but eventually. <laughs> Come anywhere near me, and I'll kill you. I don't doubt it. Don't do it, though. Who are you working for? I'm a rat in Chinese astrology. The year of the rat. Yeah, where did you go? Oh, not the picture. The wall itself. False wall. False floor. False something. False wall. Shoot it down. See, the rat showed him the way. What is it? Nothing. Interrogation, what was written before it? He was looking for him. And he sent me here to finish the... <laughs> I'm coming with you. No, you're not. Yeah, she is. What country are we going to go to next? What's going on? Well, the meeting was brought forward. Did you not get the message? No, we didn't. Seize bad news. You don't know what you're doing. It's not personal. It's the future. But, and do your thing, but why have to, like, come in and close them down? Okay, little bastard. Do your you? thing in addition to, <laughs> you know? I'll take that as a compliment. Let's go, M. No, me. Yes, thank you. <laughs> well, at least we see a little bit of the clothing getting ready. That's going to be a suit, right? He's going to get back into his suit, pressed. The first thing to do is to teach you how to protect yourself. You just point it. You squeeze the trigger. You try not to close your eyes. Mm hmm. She said she hates him. She didn't say she didn't know how to use him. <laughs> I think we'll skip hand-to-hand -hand combat. <laughs> Using the smart blood, I've tracked Bond to a point here in North Africa. We can't help him. But, sir, we know where he's headed. They just axed double O. But, sir, we know exactly where he is. Yes, I know, but if we can track him, so can others. Delete all the smart blood files. Everything. He's on his own. Which isn't the worst thing. He's good on his own. 
if M's right that the like, other people can track him if they hack into that information or access that information about the smart blood. Look at him. Where'd the suit come from though? And her dress. But they look wonderful. It gets me into trouble. It makes me do crazy things. Well, we can't have that. So I'll have the vodka martini. <laughs> You know, I think you're wrong. We always have a choice. I'll drink to that. Batista. Strength-wise, by the looks of it. Here she comes! Bond is not in a good way. Shoot! That was good. What do we do now? Did that kill him? That would kill him, right? You never know. He's big and strong. <laughs> what else do we do now? What else could we possibly do now? Perfect. <laughs> but yeah, would that have killed De Batista? Like, he's got a strong neck. Hopefully that doesn't give her like the kiss of death. You know what I mean? I feel like often he sleeps with women and then they die. So it's a risk. Waltz isn't really, um, isn't really in it that much. Oh, just to pick them up. I do love all this. I've changed my mind about not liking Bonds because the stakes aren't high because I know he survives. And now I just appreciate the the scope of the settings, the stunts. It's not all CGI, you know? It's like a lot of practical stunts, great stuntmen. And the girls are always potentially a risk. <laughs> and the locations, of course, I mean. So yeah, I'm not so worried about whether Bond will make it or not because I think that's the safe bet. Um, or at some point, does he die? I guess I'll find out eventually. But no, he can't. But yeah, don't worry about that now. Just enjoy it for the visuals, the action. Hang on, what? Hang on, what, what, what? I'm so confused. I, I thought that picture was of James Bond and his dad and somebody, um, and he died in a climbing accident and someone else died in a climbing accident, so, and forgive me if I'm jumping the gun. Is Christoph Champagne. Waltz James Bond's brother? Maybe late. <laughs> Hang on. Third. No. But that picture, who's in the picture? Who are the two we know? It was at... James Bond's family house. And it was recouped after it burned down, that one picture, and Christoph Waltz's face was missing. Um, so is he another son or cousin? Ah! Don't kill me in the comments. <laughs> right here. Which leads me to speculate exactly why you came. He doesn't know that. Is this live? Live and direct. 1620 GMT. What an uncanny coincidence. 
Money Penny. M? In the meantime, I'm sure C will keep you all busy. Thank you. C is annoying. I'm guessing our little friend C, he's one of your disciples. You could say that. What does he get out of it? He's a visionary like me. The control. It was all me, James. It's always been me, the author of all your pain. Kill him. Very cult-like. Since you mentioned your father, I'll show you. She's clever. Try the Hufflepuff Clinic. She's not looking. Look at Bond. Out of horror, beauty. You're crazy. Just easy on a superficial level. A man can watch himself. A Persian kitty? He'd gone even though he was still alive. So this brief moment between life and death, there was... Ramblings of a madman, I mean... I'm going to penetrate to where you are, to the inside of your head. Look how much he's enjoying it. Play with your sight, your hearing, and your balance. The watch. Just with the subtlest of manipulations. I'll get on with it then. Nothing can be as painful as listening to you. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this is awful. Oh, yeah, yeah. Ah! Go back to getting your watch off or doing whatever you were doing. Asked me to treat him as a brother. My little brother. Yep. They formed quite an attachment. And it was the man that we just saw at the end of the last one. You won't know who she is. Just another passing face on your way to the grave. That might not be a Persian cat. It could be a chinchilla. <sighs> He's not going to die. So come on, use the watch. <laughs> The alarm, the alarm! <laughs> Squeeze. I don't recognize you anywhere. How does she know what it's gonna do? One minute. She knows it's gonna explode. Is it a bomb? When Q said it's really loud. Never seen it. I think it means it's a bomb. Blowing up the machine the control panel opened all the locks on his ankles and head and stuff. It was convenient. <laughs> but I'm glad. Did it kill Waltz or just send him back maimed? Because he went flying back, but the explosion was kind of like in front. I'm giving them too much credit. I'm like, did Batista survive the train? <laughs> now he's gone. Why, why would that happen? But we good. Okay, but no one in there survived. That's it for for Waltz. They gotta get C and get all the double O stuff reinstated and back in action. So what do you have for me, 007? The recently deceased head of Spectre, Ernst Stavro Blofeld, and his chief of intelligence, about to take control of his very own global surveillance hmm. system that he built right here under our noses. Then we better move. The system goes online at midnight. Oh. So you and I will have a quiet word with C while Q hacks into the system and stops it going online. He'll find a way. Spectre will still take control even with that whole... It's good to have you back, 007. Sir? 
That whole base exploded? Wasn't that like a big part of the control center of the surveillance and stuff? You're saying goodbye. Thank you. You're a good man, James. Well, she's saving herself and saving her life. I'm for it. Are you in here, Q? You lay some impenetrable security still to go, but I think I'm getting somewhere. Come on, Q. Right, down to the wire. I mean, can we catch a break? It's enough. Reverse! Q didn't get hit, I don't think. But it was very close. Get him in the building. Move! in the right place. Go back and find M. Now. We need them both. Access denied on your own computer. Thanks, Q. I'm going to stop this system going online, and then I'm going to bring you in. On what grounds? Poor taste in friends. And then you're out of a job. And in jail. <laughs> Take a look at the world. Chaos. Because people like you, paper pushers and politicians, are too spineless to do what needs to be done. Is it seven minutes or something? How predictably moronic. But then isn't that what M stands for? Moron. As if there's any bullets in there. Careless. That could have been worse. <laughs> A We'll get it in seconds, I bet. Not even minutes, but seconds. Everybody, Javier, Mads. Oh, Ava. Uh, Mr. White, I don't know that actor's name, I forgot. Aw, M, Judy Dench. Performative. <laughs> You're a hard man to kill, Bluefield. Wow, so he did get out of that huge explosion. Everything blew up. This is what's left of your world. Everything you ever stood for. Everything you believed in. A ruin. Why are we here? Did you miss me? No. We can't let him go into the next film. He has to die. Three minutes, this building will be demolished. I can get out easily. Now you have a choice. Die trying to save her. Save yourself and live with the pain. I don't think so. I've really put you through it, haven't I? Well, what's brothers for you? They always know which buttons to press. So he can't get out easy because he's so deep in, but did... Where's she? Is she in there somewhere too? Let's go. Move to you. Maybe he's not gonna kill him! And he's gonna stay alive for the end of this one! After all of that. You don't matter anymore. Maybe I don't. Something has to. Kill C. Come on. He'd kill you. Nice. Then M didn't have to pull a trigger. Any word on Bond? No, but I can hazard a guess. <laughs> He's just up there watching him and taunting him. He could shoot him though, too. Do you trust me? Do I have a choice? Not anymore. Ah! That works. Did we see that net before? I didn't see it. Did we see it? Goodbye, James Bond. Stop Waltz and you know James Bond and what he's like, why would you be confident that he's definitely in there? You know what I mean? Where he's the hardest there is to kill, he's the best there is. You didn't see him 
explode. But he's just so arrogantly by Mr. Bond. No, no. Okay, that one did a little damage. What if a helicopter like that that then just crashes into the London Eye and like kills a bunch of civilians? They just take that on the chin? I mean, or a car on the bridge? Same thing. <laughs> Still not dead. <laughs> Are the pilots? Yeah, and the other guy. So this is the terrorist alert. Mallory, double O section. Stand them down. Echo team, hold fire. Stand down. But double O was like defunct as, you know, has that been put back in place? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Out a bullet. And besides, we've got something better to do. Or is this a thing where now Christoph Waltz is gonna have one last dying dash and he'll shoot him in self-defense, even though he was gonna let him live? Nope. But he's still not gonna quit his job for her and she doesn't want to be with a spy and assassin at all. So this kiss is... Under the Special Measures Act of 2001, I am detaining you on behalf of Her Majesty's government. Oh. I feel like not dead. We can't trust him and he's gonna come back. <laughs> I was like, is Q smoking? But no, it's the steam off his tea. What are you doing here? Good morning, Q. I thought you'd gone. I have. There's just one thing I need. A car. <laughs> that car, the old one. <laughs> okay, now that was good. I'm, I'm, I'm in. Um, I liked that one. I liked the cast. I liked the travel <laughs> the story and just the energy was up again. I felt like the only one I kind of lost a little bit of the sort of engagement was, um, what's the second one? Quantum of Solace. Um, but, but, uh, but that was great. But now I have questions and I feel like, cause I think there's one more in the Daniel Craig series, right? So like there'll be time, a time to die, no time to die. That's my next and final in this installment. Um, but he can't quit again. He's always like quitting for these women. He's like, yeah, okay, I won't be an assassin anymore. So I hope that she doesn't have to die at the start of the next one for him to come back to his job. Um, but we shall see. And I also think that had Christoph Waltz been killed, then that would be more of a wrap up, but he was not, he's not just gonna disappear. He's not gonna just, because he's incarcerated, right? So does he appear in the next one as the villain again and escape and kill her? I don't know. So to find out with me, or you guys probably already know, but to watch me find out, I will see you here next time on Criminal Content. So thanks for watching. Bye.